Good afternoon, Westside Wildcats. Here are your announcements for Tuesday, December 8th, 2020. Today's lunch is twin cheeseburgers, broccoli, mandarin oranges, and milk. Don't forget about these awesome clubs. Club forms must be turned in to stay. Forms can be found in the office. A bus is provided on club days. See the list of clubs on the right in the days they are offered. Walking club Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Crafting club Wednesdays and Thursdays. Homework help Monday, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Thursdays. Exercise exploration club Mondays and Thursdays. Creative writing club Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Chess club Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Junior Optimist International Club Mondays and Tuesdays, Mondays and Thursdays. Sorry about that. Mondays and Thursdays. Matt Club Wednesdays and Thursdays. Robotics Mondays and Thursdays. And Kahoot Club Mondays and Thursdays. Anyone interested in an academic quiz bowl? We are looking for students who want to have fun and learn some cool new things. You can do one subject or all four. Yes, you can join if you are e-learning. We will have Google Meet practices too. Contact Mr. Lovely for math, Mrs. Schultz for social studies, Mrs. Kidder for science, and Mrs. Berkey for English. Don't forget about the West Side's 14 Days of Christmas. Wear the specific theme dress to earn some cat cash and then submit your picture virtually to Mrs. Smith at spsmith at lcart.k12.in.us to earn some cat cash. So today was wear black and white like a penguin. Tomorrow, when you're virtual, wear your favorite cowboy gear. And then on Thursday, wear your favorite winter hat. And this week, we started our 10 Days of Cut. Uh, kindness challenge. Yesterday, we gave compliments to as many people as possible. Today, we're spreading good gossip, not bad gossip. And on Wednesday, thank people that you take for granted, like your parents sometimes, or maybe even teachers and staff here at school. And then on Thursday, remember to give your give someone your place in line. On the fourth day of reading, my librarian gave to me How to Disappear, and then also Ivy Aberdeen's Letter to the World. For the fifth day of reading, my librarian gave to me, Marcus Vega doesn't speak Spanish by Pablo Cartaya. Marcus is the biggest kid around and he uses it to his advantage. From cell phone and trash talk to acting as a bodyguard, he knows how to use his size to make money. But when his family goes to Puerto Rico for spring break, Marcus is going to discover exactly who he is and what his role in his family can be. And the miscalculations of Lightning Girl by Stacey Mc. Anolti. 12 year old Lacey Callahan is a mass savant courtesy of a lightning strike when she was eight. Now she has to navigate the hardest thing ever middle school. Last week's library winners for the 12 days of reading were Isabella Teitzma, Leslie Chavaria, Jameson Bertram, Isaac Canegas, Rodriguez, Mackenzie Wittergren, and Layla Yoder. Go to the library to claim your prize when you have a chance and keep reading. Boys Volleyball will have a skills evaluation on December 13th from 3 to 5.30. Signups are outside of Mr. Thomas's office across from the library. More information will come in the next few weeks. Wrestling starts on January 4th, which is different than it's normally been listed in the announcements. January 4th, not January 7th. Signups are outside Mr. Thomas's office across from the library. More information to come soon. And girls basketball trials are Tuesday, December 15th through Thursday, December 17th from 3 to 5 at Westside. E-learners must find their own ride back to school. You must have a sports physical on file to try out for the team. If you have any questions, you can email Coach Hennings at khennings at lcart.k12.in.us. 7th grade A team beat Schmucker Thursday 36 to 28. And 7th grade A team beat Northside Tuesday by a score of 38 to 26. Leading the way in scoring were Jeremiah Winder with 10 and Chase Fussard with 9. Due to the current level of the pandemic, no students will be allowed to attend the basketball games. As this changes, listen to announcements for further updates. The kindness quote of the week is, Be kinder to yourself and then let your kindness flood the world. Be persistent, be respectful, take initiative, be dependable, and be efficient. Say this with me. I am trying. I am kind. I am growing. I am all in. Have a great day, Wildcats.